Hi, Miss Rossi here, and today we are going to make a model of the solar system on a piece of sentence strip paper, or you can use cash register tape and cut the paper as long as your arms can stretch. You also need a pencil, and if you have some solar system stickers lying around your house, this could be a fun addition. So to begin, take your paper or sentence strip and you can make a prediction of how far apart the planets are from the sun. So on one end, lightly with your pencil, make your prediction. So write sun all the way to our dwarf planet friend Pluto if you want. Remember, you can always hit pause on this video so you can write the name of the planet before moving on. When you're done making your prediction, let's turn it over to the other side and let's see how far apart the planets really are. So to begin, you are going to fold your sentence strip in half so the ends touch just like this. And we are going to write sun on top. Sun. And this halfway part is Uranus. So on the fold, we are going to write Uranus. Now take it from the bottom and fold up to Uranus. And on that fold, we are going to write Neptune. So now we have the Sun, Uranus, and Neptune. So notice we skip some. We're not necessarily going in order, and that's because of how we're folding things. So now let's start at the Sun and fold down to Uranus. So again, all of our folds are in half right now. And on that fold, we will, we will write Saturn. And then from the sun, fold to Saturn. And here's where we will write Jupiter. And now br let's bring the sun to Jupiter. And we are going to write Mars. Now we are going to bring the sun to Mars. And we are going to write Venus. Nick you're like, Miss Rossi, how many more folds can I possibly make? You could try to fold. Otherwise, what you can do is halfway between the sun and Venus, write Mercury. And halfway between Venus and Mars, write Earth. So your sentence strip now has the planets in the correct order. So this is a model about to scale. It's not 100% accurate, but we have now made a model of the solar system. And you can do your best to put the stickers on in the correct spot. So you have the sun, Mercury, So you could see how close all of these planets are that are right near the sun and how far apart they get later on. So this is one form of a model. 
the stained glass behind me is another model. What other models do we have of the solar system? When you're all done with all of your planets, you can turn it over and see your predictions. How close were you with how far apart all the planets were? Then glue your solar system model into your science notebook.